We're going to start off by talking about the guy that everybody wants to know. Can he make it? Four straight CrossFit Games championships. Rich Froning. At the time, he was miles in front of anyone else. There's no way to describe it. I mean, he's just driven. First year, like we were doing this, we were only doing like one workout a day, and now I can't even tell you what his, his number's at. Do I change her before the bottle or after the bottle? Before. Shoot. Oh, wow. <laughs> Open that one up. Yeah, it's bad. Okay, it's okay. Get a wipe ready. Okay, when you leave, and then when you open. Open that one up and use oh, the... Okay, you're good. Yeah, you're good, good to go. Is Rich Froning the fittest man in history? We need to see a snapshot of his physical capabilities against as many possible physical challenges as you can dream up and against as many people as you can possibly put him against. Anybody is beatable on any given day. That's the type of heart that's gonna take down Rich. If you don't have that, you're not taking down Rich. I wanna see somebody beat him at the games. Running now, Rich Froning starting to. He's never been in this position. He's never had a score like this. So, so at that point, I'd honestly thought my chances of winning the CrossFit Games were over. And once again, I'm going to let everyone around here know: you guys are working out with me. I'm not working out with you. He is stupid competitive. Pictionary, he doesn't like losing that Pictionary. <laughs> he is without a doubt the fittest man in history.